folks, it's Luke from GAK at NAM with Alex from Fender. Uh, we're going to take a look at some of the new models for 2014. So, what have we got here? So, Jim Root Jazzmaster. So, he's been uh, experimenting with the Jazzmaster platform for a couple of years now. He had like a maple neck, kind of blonde one. He eventually landed on this, uh, this black one. And it's got the, exactly the same feature set as the uh, Strat and the Tele. So, the EMGs in it, the 81 and the 85. Compound radius. Uh, ebony fretboard, jumbo frets, you know, simple switching and a, and a volume knob. They, they look like the new EMGs with the brushed yeah. chrome, the metalwork. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's got the yeah the new sort of non-black finish to it, and then sat finish at the back of the neck, black tuners, locking, so it's super stable, you know, really high output, you know, sounds great. Uh, you know, kind of like a Strat and Tele, but just in a, completely in a different shape. I mean, it's you know, it's uh, it's nothing like a, a normal Jazzmaster. <laughs> it's like take everything from the Jazzmaster and strip it out and, and make it its own. And you know, it sounds sounds great for a high gain amp. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yesterday with us celebrating the 60th anniversary of the Strat, and he's a super cool guy, and he's he, banging he, into his gear. And he bought a Strat, I think, from from our shop. Uh huh. He, nice. He was in town and needed one, yeah. uh, and popped in and bought it off the wall. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, he, that's the whole thing with him is that it's like the production line of guitars are exactly what he uses, and you know, he, he genuinely did. He, yeah. No one clocked him. He walked in, bought it, and it was only when he tweeted about it later. Cool. Yeah, he's yeah, yeah, it's really nice like that. Troy Van Leeuwen hasn't been in our shop. No, no, so but he well. has got his own signature jazz master. Oh, what kind of guy? So, um, you know, Queens of the Stone Age, um, you know, failure, perfect circle. So, quite the influential guy in his uh, in his sphere, you know. Yeah. So, this is a Mexican guitar. And it's kind of it's had all the sensible upgrades on it, so uh, it's got a Mustang-style bridge on it. These are actually brass saddles with a chrome plating, so super stable. You know, it won't slip off or anything. The pickups are the same pickups that we're doing in our American Vintage series, uh, which hat knobs, a bound block neck, matching headstock, and circuitry is, is, is pretty much stock. It's got the rhythm circuit, but he's replaced the, the, just the two-way switch with this. Something a bit circuit. easier to get to, yeah. a bit easier to use. Yeah, uh, it comes in this original color, you know, that he worked with us on, Oxblood. Sort of matches the walls. Yeah, Oxblood Metallic. It's like somewhere, it's sort of a really, really dark crimson, you know? And so sometimes it actually looks like it's black in certain lights. and. I think it looks amazing. I yeah, think it's really, really I'm cool. I'm in love with that thing. Really, really cool. Cool. You know? And uh, I mean, those sensible upgrades, it's, it's, it makes it super stable as well. You know? How a jazz master should be. It's kind yeah. of, everyone does it. Yeah. Why not do it from yeah, the start? Yeah, yeah exactly. Exactly. So, uh, the Kurt Cobain has got uh, a new makeover. So, this is like uh, a NOS finish on it. So, so it's exactly the same as the existing Cobain, but instead of the road-worn finish, you get you know a nice glossy, uh, straight out of the factory finish to it. So, you know, based upon his classic guitar from the classic period, obviously, uh, super distortion Demarzio pickups, you know, super stable bridge and yeah, switch and everything, and you know, it's just as his would have started out. You know, it's, it's such a quirky guitar and, and it, it's, you know, the songs that inspired him, you know, it's just, you know, it's, it's, it's a legend, really. Fresh out of the box for you to smash up yourself. Exactly. It's like he's never had it. Exactly, exactly. You know, it's, uh, he actually bought it like this. Uh, there's a left-handed version, obviously. Um, he bought it like that. He did, it wasn't modified or anything. Oh, really? Someone else had done everything to it and he bought it exactly in that kind of state you know and, and no that. one's ever come forward to say you know <laughs> that that was my guitar i did that and you know so if you're out there just give us yeah, a call yeah, exactly. uh, we'd love to find you i mean it's super weird you know you've got a spaghetti logo on a jaguar which is just like impossible yeah, it never yeah, yeah, happened yeah. you know and <laughs> it's it's you know i think you know we all we all kind of like hold his music like really close to our hearts you know and uh, you know it's just great to be able to reinvigorate it you know 20 years later for the kids <laughs>
How about the selects? The selects, we got uh, two new ones coming out this year. Um, we're going with this uh, channel bound neck which we introduced last year. So basically the, the fretboard is inlaid into the neck, okay? So it looks like it's a bound neck and stuff, but it, um, you'll see that there's no binding on there whatsoever. So it's actually channel, there's a channel cut out of the rosewood in this case. Uh, so, so that it's sort of routed and then... It's routed and then, and then the, the, the fretboard slots into it, you know, really snugly. It's all, you know, done by computers and stuff and it's super stable. Um, we've got a rosewood version here. The, the inlay, the, 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 the routed part logo on the headstock looks unreal. Yeah, yeah, it looks really cool. You know, something that we've never done before. And, you know, it's the select platform. It's taken like the best tone woods, best pickups, you know. Every one of these is going to be completely unique, these tops, you know. Um, we've got an HSS version with a rosewood neck with a maple inlay. And then an SSS version with a rosewood board on a bird's eye maple neck. Are so these limited? They are limited in quantity, yeah. So they're only going to be available probably, you know, for about three months of the year. Um, if you yeah. want it, get it now. Yeah, exactly. Get them whilst they're hot.